Titans versus Bad Boys. Logic snap. Gonna throw middle complete. Great catch and run. Just what they need to get something going so early. And looks like it's an eligible man downfield apparently on Titans to start. Try to fix this as fast as we can. This game snuck up on me, I'm not gonna lie. I thought there might be a little bit of a break. Hey, you are trying to blame down the receiver. There we go, now we're set. Bad Boys, Maryland Titans. Scoreboard set. Graphic set. Get that frame ready. What'd you see? Lock on the run. Good run there. Just what you need to get this team warmed up. Been a long wait for both of these squads. What you see, Ross? He saw nothing. What you see, you did not see. There we go. Oh, I got no idea. <laughs> I'm on the bleachers. You might have heard someone on the bleachers messing around. <laughs> Titans bad boys. Last check of bias PME was 17 to 6 in the fourth quarter. Charles Powell has that one over there on field two. They're about to start Rampage Team Penny right after that. Another game very similar to this one where it's been a long way. This is where it's picking up too. Left side complete. Maryland Titans. B champions of Capital Classic 2021. They defeated Baez Auto, who is over there right now playing. Albeit a much different Baez Auto team than the one we saw in this tournament. That's the one that we have referred to as Boone Auto. Chris Boone and company joining up with Baez. And so far in two tournaments, it might be leading to two semifinal appearances, which is huge for both sides. Rock throwing it right up there. Intercepted. Pitch back. Pulled right down. Here we go. Here comes Bad Boys on offense. Charm City B Division champion. They defeated Outcast, who had actually beaten the Maryland Titans in the semifinals. The Titans making a run at Charm City. Bad Boys coming into this one. They were a semifinalist at the last Capital Classic. 
Classic in the B Division to the Maryland Titans. Titans to be on 33-19. That was Doc last year with the Titans. This year it's Locke, who was the Titans quarterback in 2016 when they won the Mason-Dixon Classic here in November in the B Division. A victory over the Red Knights in that one. Ray Wagner in the backfield. And complete. And this is going to be the factor, Mr. Ray Wagner. Talk about it, the controversy surrounding him, leaving Baez Auto. He was out of the team. Caleb came back in, played quarterback for them. Now it's Chris Boone. That team has been on a major shuffle since the last Capital Classic. It's over the ride Ray Wagner's been on. He got the bad boys to the semis at B Nationals. Couldn't beat the St. Louis Spartans, however. In the backfield now. Tip batted and complete. Almost a pick. Ocean City. He got them to the championship of the B division. Lost to Playmakers Elite. Didn't have the best AC, but they bounced back in Charm City. Did excellent there. Won that tournament. Four dominant performances in a row that weekend by the Bad Boys on that Sunday. Blowout well, victory over the Killer Bees. They just got by TMU. Should be interesting to see if those two meet again come Nationals. Left side, complete. That's going to be a match up there. Wagner and Peters run together. That combination was key for Baez last year, early on in the year. We saw it pay dividends. Ray did guide Baez Auto to the Ocean City Beat Ship. Lost to Rampage. Remember that Sunday night game we had for you at OC? Got him in the A Division to the quarterfinals. Ran into a tough main event team at Charm City last year. Lost to Rampage in the semifinals at Clash of York 3. Left after that, Baez got to the Capital Classic B Championship, but Ray went on his way. Joined up with the Bad Boys in January. We mentioned it, runners up in Ocean City. Champion in Charm City, and this punt's gonna go to the wayside. And that's a whistle. I believe that is quarter called, yes, sir. Not? Yep. Okay, never mind. I got confused there for a second. I want to mark it back there, actually. Further back than I thought it was. That's why I was confused. I thought they might have been flipping fields. But we're still in the first 0-0. Zero, zero. <laughs> If you're watching, feel free to share. Share everywhere. Complete left side. Oh my. Oh my. That's a hit. That's a grown man's play. Big game. Big game. Maryland Titans. Talk about it, this is a team that is not gonna back down to anybody. One of the tougher nine-man teams I've seen in this region. First time I caught a glimpse of them was at that Hagerstown tournament six years back. I was on the sideline for too much talent when they lost to the Titans in that semifinal. Trying to get magic catcher here today. Locker has done himself. Pull down, looks like along the sideline. Titans wanted the flag there. Matching the quarterback carousel for the Titans. Locke was out most of last year. Doc came in at Nationals, did a great job. Got to the quarterfinals. Biggest obstacle they had all of last year was Rampage. It's just could not get past him on Sunday quarterfinal matchups. Had a tough draw as well with the Browns at AC. This was a team that 
always in the thick of things. Got some wins on the Misfits. Played everybody in the top of this region closely. Beat a lot of good teams along the way. Lock, Doc won the championship. Lock returned since. They at one point had Greg Proctor there for a brief period. But Proctor tiring a Scorpion. Lock throws left side. And complete. Titans, bad boys. Hey, Zoe! No, I'm FFL, man. Huh? Yeah, no. Nah, I want to get the high angle. I want to get a good angle. I want to get your best view. <laughs> i do it for the fans line now. I'm a little lazy. I've always said if I can get a booth view, I prefer to do that just so I can do good shots like these. Everybody say be on the field though. That is quarter, so at the end of the first, it is zero zero. Second quarter underway. Zero, zero here between Bad Boys and the Maryland Titans. We are in the quarterfinal round. One of two quarterfinals going on right now. Looks like I'm trying to see who's playing over there right now. I can't even get a good look. <laughs> I thought I heard someone go ready, so I'm guessing it's... Looks like PME and Baez just went final. Ball star coming up here. I can't tell who won. If anybody knows, let me know. I want to say, let's we'll see. Yeah, it looks like PME Baez is final. I don't have a winner though offhand. Nah, we're still in the quarters. Catch. No, it complete. So Baez victorious. All right, thanks everybody. Couldn't get a good view there. So Baez Auto to the semifinals. They will take on the winner of Rampage versus Team Petty. It's gonna be a good one when that matchup comes up, semifinal. We're over here in the second quarter of this quarterfinal. Winner of this one will be taking on main event in the semis. Bad Boys and the Maryland Titans. Defending Capital Classic B champion, although one championship this year, so they're going for broke. Left side. Lock running it in. Let's see. They're saying he might have been pulled. I don't see any touchdown signal. Yes, they're going to roll touchdown as it touched with the knee down short of the end zone. And here come the bad boys. So 
Now for those of you just tuning in, Baez Auto has knocked off PME. PME eliminated in the quarterfinals here in Capital Classic. Baez will be taking on either Rampage or Team Petty in the semis. That game is coming up over there on the field too soon. and run. That was Wagner to Jaleel. Jaleel, former quarterback of the Renegades, was the original quarterback of Bad Boys. Helped the Renegades win Clash of York 2 two years ago when they defeated a couple of their teammates who were there of Aftermath in that one. That was the genesis of Bad Boys. Oh, took it right from him. Big catch. Big catch there by Kirk. That combination, we saw what it did for Baez Auto. Gave main event fits. Could it give them fits today? We'll see. Quarterfinal about to start there. We are officially down to five teams in this tournament. 16th rather. Main event is in the semis. Baez Auto on the other side. Still left in this tournament. Bad Boys, Maryland Titans, Rampage, Team Petty. Complete right side. Pull right down. Catch on side there by Eddie Thomas. Championship is slated for 5 o'clock. This game is on time. The other field, if we're being technical, is 38 minutes behind. Wait, right side. Very catch and run. I should say not 38, I'm closer to 25 minutes behind, depending on when they get this next one started. But field one getting done is key because it does allow them to be set for when field two does get completed. teams that faced off in Maffle last year. Titans. Rematch of a semifinal game last year. And there were a few of the Renegades, I believe, that were with them when the Renegades beat the Maryland Titans in the 2019 semifinal of the Capital Classic. 
three division. Sounds like offsides on the Titans coming up now. And you can tell the this weather has slowed these two down completely. They've gotten success here and there, but for the most part, this was a long wait. You had to think three to four hours between games from both sides. Meanwhile, it looks like Rampage and Team Petty is underway down there. Winner will take on Baez Auto. Wagner. No. Go low. Incomplete. Quarterfinal matchup. Two games left on this field. Semi-final in the chip. One more game on field two after this. That'll be Baez Auto versus the winner of Rampage and hashtag Team Petty. Looks like we got a score out the gate down on the other side. And if the indication is what I think it is, that is a touchdown for Team Petty out the gate. Right side, complete. Wagner to Thomas. Team Petty of a hot start on Rampage. They met back in Ocean City, although it was a bit of a different Petty than the one that Rampage is playing right now. Timeout, bad boys. Oh, we'll be under the lights. We, see, we do have lights. It is cold, though. Shoot. <laughs> So it's complete. Yep, we're moving the puck. Very good. Well, keeps talking to Andy, man. Personal foul on the Titans. Wow, okay. So keep calling a personal foul on the Titans. After him and Andy confer to the good field. I didn't get a good look at it, but that's going to be a game for bad boys. Should be 15 yards, first and goal coming up. Two minute warning has been called. Zero zero in this very, very slow paced first half. Not the offensive fireworks we used to see from bad boys. The Titans riding their way through this one. Oh, it complete. Temperature is supposed to dip into the lower 40s before we get to the chip tonight. We're going to have some cold, cold weather here on Tucker Road. This is what we call football weather. It's that fall time of the year here in Nine Man. Final tournament before Nationals. I'm sure some teams might have some get-togethers around the holidays. It up, incomplete. complete. 
Good catch across the middle. Yes, touchdown, bad boys. Six nothing. Six nothing. Bad boys up early. That's the offensive attack we've been talking about coming into this one. Kick up six seven zero. Seven nothing, bad boys. And now come the Maryland Titans offense. Second down coming up. Winner of this game to take on main event next. Short the call. Right? Yes, sir. Keep saying it's a catch. Big gain first down. Four the bat for the Maryland Titans rather. <laughs> Lock. Rebound. Forty-seven seconds left here in the first half. Seven nothing, bad boys. Against the Maryland Titans. Battle of two OMFFL teams here on Tucker Road. Other side, Rampage T. Petty. Two teams that played here at Maffa last spring. Throws way too low to complete. Third down coming up for the Maryland Titans. 42 seconds remaining.
42 seconds here in the first half. Titans bad boys. Titans in the white bad boys and red and some gray. And we're sapped at. Gonna throw out way back there. Great interception. Great pitch. And a great opportunity now if you are the bad boys. Not what you needed if you were the Maryland Titans. An interception. And as a result, bad boys are having a midfield. 7 0 lead. I think I, heard, I think I heard 47 just now. What is the time? Free play, I'm hearing. Oh my. Oh my. What a play. First and goal for the bad boys. And now this offense is warming up. They've sat all morning waiting for this moment and they're ready to rise to the occasion. But they got a monster in main event coming in the shadows. If they are to win this game, they're going to have a tough, tough battle. Look at some of the quarterbacks left. To the advanced. Mike DeMardelier, main event, Chris Boone, Baez, Auto. Boone won Mason Dixon five years ago. The A championship he won down there, up in there, up there rather in Hagerstown with Adrenaline Rush. Could he do it five years later? Not to the exact weekend, but five years. Throws <laughs> right side, clock running. Two quarterbacks here, Ray Wagner, Bad Boys, Lock Edwards, Maryland Titans. Two over there, Chris Pice on Rampage. Bo Hill for Team Petty. Bo, it might be James Battle back out there now. They've been alternating. Seven accomplished QBs in those positions. Field goal coming here. Yes, Half time, we'll be right back. Bad boys on the Titans field goal just before half. Titans to kick it off here. On field two, it is Rampage set or set or Petty seven. Rampage nothing, I believe. Rampage or Petty. The other quarterfinal matchup. Winner of that to take on Baez Auto. In the semis. <laughs> Officials aren't even back on the field yet. I don't. Everybody was in a rush, so we're back. Second half underway. Finally, for real this time. Ten nothing, bad boys. Correction was seven nothing rampage over there. 
I thought Petty might have scored earlier, but maybe I misunderstood. The score I got on the other live is 10 0. Chaz Powell has that game over on the nine man page. This whistle blows. Yes, yeah, Drive resulting in 10 points overall for the bad boys. The 10 0 lead here against the Maryland Titans with main event looming. Wagner throws left side. Hold down. to get here for both sides. Bad Boys won the 9 a.m. game of a dream, 28 to 12. And Maryland Titans defeat the south side. Both games filmed by Charles Powell. Rampage of Petty playing over there. One more game left. Some championship on this field. Ball deep, Eddie. That's all you have to say is Eddie. Touchdown, bad boys. Sixteen nothing bad boys. We talked about who had come out hot or cold in this game. Both the team said for a while bad boys have warmed up. And I'll tell you, Ray Wagner is ready for the rematch of Mike DeMartelier. After that quarterfinal last year at Charm, he is ready for the rematch. But they got to hold on to a 16 point lead now on the Maryland Titans.
Sweet metal. Hold. Hold is coming. Uh, complete big game Titans starting to have a chance down the field Two failed drives out here in the red zone for Titans. And that has been the difference. See the 
bad boys can do. Coming up for the bad boys. Winner of this will take on main event in the semifinals. With the winner taking on either Baez, Auto, Rampage, or Team Petty for the championship. Quarter's called. So at the end of the third quarter, it's 17 0. And they'll flip the field. And we're going to take a long little break. We'll be right back. We're back, fourth quarter. Stepping up, moving around. Ray right, was on wheels himself. Ray Wagner. Wagner on wheels. Pitches it back. I think that's Eddie got it. Oh my. What a play. First down. Bad boys. What a run by Ray. That's a song I'm not accustomed to hearing at a flag event, but all right. We all had a good moment at home. to hear Hank Williams at a, at a flag football event? Left side, complete. Bad boys can't survive. me no I never connected the Bluetooth that's not my soundtrack <laughs> I know the song but it's not my soundtrack <laughs> Middle, but blown dead. Pre snap whistle, it appears.
mobility is scary. Fourth quarter. Titans looking like they're about ready to get out of here themselves. They're going to fight to the very end, but they know it's been a long day just waiting around alone. Bad boys will have potentially two more games left. Anybody got any updates on the right patch, Patty? Right side. Pull down shy the end zone. 420 and running. We'll call it on a bad boys touchdown here, potentially. We'll see. They've already blown one free score lead this year. down coming up for the bad boys 17 nothing here in the fourth quarter Touchdown, bad boys. Straight to Eddie. 23 nothing. Yeah, we're going to take a break on that note. Bad boys to the semis. Actually, they're going to call it on that note. Bad boys to the semis. They win it 23 nothing. I'm Joey Blaze. I'll be back in a few.